Hi guys, welcome to the Red Cliff Lifestyle Vlog. So you know it's your girl, Tamika. Um, today I'll be cooking up something. So what am I gonna call myself? So my husband is Chef Walla Walla or Chef Walla Ben. I don't know. I am Chef trying something. Yeah. <laughs> uh, maybe I don't know what I'm gonna call myself. Chef what? No, I'm not no chef nothing. This is my um, pretending cooking. That's what I'm gonna call this. So hi guys, welcome to pretending cooking. However, um, so today I'll be cooking something different from the norm. I'll be making, I think it's called um, Tuscan chicken, I think that's what it is, or pasta. But I've been making some pasta with some chicken thing. I don't know the name of it. You know what it is already. I have, um, so let me show you what I have. Oh, and before I go any further, please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Also, turn that notification bell on so that you can get all our notifications. Please, please, please turn that post notification button on. All right? So let me show you what I want, Abby. Cooking. I don't know. I think I want to do. I don't know if I should say pretending cooking or if I could say I'm gonna find a right term for it. So for today, I don't know. I'm confused. Can you give me a name for my chef thing, please? I don't know. I'm not the chef, but I'm trying something. So you can comment comment below and give me a name as to what I should name myself, cause I'm not. A chef and I'm not really a cook but here I am trying some all right so here I have some chicken breasts right there I think it's about four or five pieces that's a chicken breast that I'll be using and then over here I have um, the fettuccine now this is the one that I have I normally use the one in the box I don't remember the name but this is the one that I currently have now so this is what I'll be using um, here I have some onions some chopped onions and then I have some chopped garlic right there. I have this Alfredo sauce. I think I may use some of it. Um, I think I may use some of it. I have these crushed pepper, right? I'll be using that. Then I have my Italian seasoning, right? I am also gonna be using some paprika, right? Uh, I'm gonna be adding some of this in there, the garlic and herbs, uh, Miss Dash or Dash seasoning. I think I'm going to be adding some of that in there. Then over here I have my Parmesan cheese. I'll be adding that to this. I have some salt right there. And then I also have some grated seeds, um, some grated uh, Parmesan cheese as well. So, oh, and I also have me some baby spinach because that's what I'll be adding to it just the same. I hope I'm not missing out anything else. Oh, and also... I will be adding um, some blue cheese, um, what's this, not blue cheese. I'll be using some heavy cream, the whipped cream, I'll be using some heavy cream. I'm also going to be using um, some butter as well. So here I have my butter right here. I'll be using some butter as well. Um, so focus, good, perfect. So I have my butter there as well. I won't be using all the butter, but I'll be showing you as I go along. Yeah, over here, I currently have the water boiling for the pasta. Um, and then this is what I'll be doing everything else and I'll be cooking it down in that. So I'll keep you guys posted as to my next step. And then, you know, there's no such thing um, as cooking and not drinking. So I'm having some red wine while I do this cooking thing. Um, so I went ahead and add some salt to my boiling water. I also add some more water in it. So I'm waiting for that to start boiling all over again. Then I'm gonna be doing that, right? In the meantime, um, while I'm waiting for this water to be boiled up, let me season the chicken. So that's the meat after it's all been seasoned, right? And then um, 
so I'll be using about half of the bag of it um, hopefully it can fit in this pot hopefully it works that's what that is so I put that there and I'm gonna let that boil I'm gonna be starting with the meat now so let's get this started I'm gonna turn the stove on and then I'll be using some oil. I don't have olive oil, so I'll be using just regular oil. So this is what that is, right? That's how that is. That's the chicken in there. So I'm gonna be um, cooking it maybe for about um, anywhere four to six minutes on each side until it's cooked. So, and then I will continue afterwards. I'm gonna be taking it out. Let me check on this to ensure so look at that, it's looking nice, but it's not yet ready. So I'm gonna be leaving that for a few, let that stay there. Um, let's see something here. So that's the chicken there. I'm gonna be turning them and then checking on it. So I'll be taking this off right now. Right, I'm taking that off. And then I'm gonna throw the water off. I'm not gonna let it stay in the water. I take the first set of chicken out. That's what they look like. And then now I have that one in. So let me throw this off. Uh, let's do this. So I throw it off in here. And then I let that sit there. Oh my goodness, sorry. <laughs> I wasn't thinking about the steam. <laughs> I really wasn't thinking about the steam. However, that's the fettuccine right there. And then um, the chicken is on the other set of chicken is right here. So I'm waiting for that to finish. And then I'll be moving on to the neck. I took the chicken out and I cut it like that because that's gonna be on top. And then um, this is what um, the sauce is coming like so far. Um, while this is doing, I'm now gonna go ahead and input the baby spinach. Um, I turned it down so that I can do the chicken. So I'm now gonna put the baby spinach in. I'm gonna give it about another minute or two and then put the baby spinach in. So guys, I did indeed went ahead and put the spinach in. I add the spinach to it. It's like um, about two handful of the spinach that I added. That's what it is. I'm gonna be now um, adding the the pasta to it, the fettuccine pasta. I'm now gonna be adding it to it. And then I'm also, what I did as well is I went ahead and also cut up some additional chicken. Um, so that's gonna go on top, but then this, I'm gonna just add it in there in the meantime, just to add some chicken to um, the pasta. So that's what it is. It's coming to a boil. See that bubbling? Bubbling, bubbling, bubbling. Let me see if I can turn this to a little higher. You see that? It's coming to a boil. I didn't put the Alfredo sauce. I may put just a little bit. Um, I may put just a little on it, but that's what that is. And then now let me go ahead and add the um, fettuccine. So guys, I did indeed add the fettuccine in there. Also added some more um, paprika along with the Italian seasoning and then a little salt, right? Um, because it was tasting a little fresh in my opinion. So I added a little salt to it. And then I, I didn't put that much of a salt because I'll be adding the cheese soon. So um, remember I told you that I did um, add some, I'm gonna be adding some chicken to it. So let me go ahead and put that chicken in right now. And then I can um, continue with that portion of it. So as you can see, let's put the chicken in. All right, you see that? You see that? Nice. All right, so I think that's what I'm gonna be letting it stay at. Um, 
yeah I'm gonna let that much stay in there so that's the chicken that I'll be using that's in there right and then I'm gonna stir everything all together I'm gonna go ahead and stir everything together now so that's what it is when I stir it around um, I'm gonna go ahead and now add the Parmesan cheese right um, I'm gonna now go ahead and add the Parmesan cheese so that's what it is I didn't use too much of the sauce oh I also added some of um, the um, some of the Alfredo sauce right I did I don't know why I did but I did I did add some of it so this is what it is that's what it looks like so I will be showing you guys my presentation I don't know I may put a little let me just put a little more cheese on top let me just put a little more cheese on top mm. yep so that's it for the cheese let me start now and then I'll show you the presentation soon okay guys so that is the finish look look at it tell me what you think comment below and tell me what you think of my little creation my little fake cooking trying to cook thing so thank you so much again for watching thanks for being on here with me Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe.